No, Johnny, just when I thought it wasn't going to rain, yeah. it's starting to rain. Well, it's just sprinkling. They're just sprinkling, eh? Yeah. I think we'll be fine. Yeah. I think it's just going to be misty and pleasant. It's only about 8 degrees, though, at the moment, isn't it? Yeah. What do you scheme? Some of the best scenery I've ever seen. Hey, how yeah. good is that, hey? Beautiful. Right in here was amazing. And you know that view behind you, Mom and I spent probably a day yeah. trying to get that view. And the clouds just never never stopped coming. They just kept on coming and coming and coming. Right. Mm. And it's beautifully quiet, hey? I can't believe what a good uh, ride it was. It's amazing. Mm. It actually hasn't been that cold. No. It's, it got down to about five. Yeah. So I was just watching the ice thing, but the, the roads are relatively dry. Yeah, they are pretty dry. See, there's even some blue sky up there. Hear all the birds and stuff. Eh? So, great first two hours in Tasmania. Yeah. Where we am? Top of a mountain. Yeah, but where have we just been? Uh, Queenstown. See behind you. There you go, Queenstown. That's what we're going into. It's going to be bleak. So this is where we're staying tonight. Bronte Park. It's a really nice area and uh, there's lakes all over the place and the guys uh, when we stopped you can see a guy standing there in the orange top and he was saying oh we saw you in Queenstown they have for the next three days they're going fishing and it's freezing so I said guys you're gonna freeze on the water and he said no 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 the trout love it at those cold temperatures so that's where they are or well, what they're doing Either way, it's warm. The shower was just fantastic.
fantastic after a day spent on the bike with it not getting above 10 degrees all day thank goodness for heated grips and heated jackets otherwise we would have been in trouble but anyway it was a brilliant day brilliant day well it's been a fantastic day i must say just riding with jono it's just um been brilliant i can't believe it it's uh it's monday uh have already been riding uh, since Friday afternoon it's just gone so fast but uh, really really fantastic riding with him and he's really good he um, he's safe he knows what to do and he uh, he uh, is very considered in his uh, in his riding and I must say today he was leading leading us into our um, place where we're staying tonight and he really was riding well even though the road was wet he was uh, cautious but not tentative and um, he took a good line it's brilliant brilliant riding with him and uh, it's going to be fantastic the next two days in Tassie and then up to meet the boys in the thread but really looking forward to meeting them but I'm just as excited about these next two days it's going to be fantastic because as you can see the weather's clearing up and I think it's really really going to be brilliant um, no well there are lots of clouds around but as you can see the sun's out and it's really warm I'm just in a t-shirt so um, it's going to be uh, another two days of brilliant riding in Tasmania really looking forward to it so what do you think about the trip so far Jono? I think it's been going very well yeah yeah and how was today very good wet yeah good ride and good, good no ride issues yet. with navigation no you didn't get lost once went to the first got you to lunch Lunch was good as well. Yeah. Yeah. Excellent. So a good day, eh? Hey? Good day. And now where are we? Uh, I don't know either. No, it's called... Um, what is it called? Bronte Park. Bronte Park, that's yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. So it might snow today or tonight. So we'll have to see. Yeah. But anyway, so we might go on the dirt tomorrow or not. We'll check in the pub tonight. Yeah. And depending if it rains tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Well, if you're looking for a sign that proves that Tasmania is motorcycle friendly, here it is. This is uh, just a little entrance hall to just a place near our room. And I discovered all these uh, little magazines on motorbikes and cars. And then obviously over here, something on fishing, which is central to this area that we're in. So this is my hero son. We're in a cabin out in the wilderness and he's double locked the door just in case 